three tips to become more attractive. Before we start, let me give small bonus to all my replay viewers. Right now, drop replay in the comments, and when you do, I make sure that I visit your page and show you some love. I want to give you some love because I want to show you how much I appreciate you. So replay in the comments, and let me ask you, like, have you ever had that doubt that, you know, asking yourself, why would anyone listen to me? I had that doubt. I don't know about you, but I had that doubt also. And it took me quite some time. And the reality check with this one is you've already lost. If you're asking yourself, if you're asking yourself, why would anyone listen to you? Then you've already lost because you don't believe in yourself and you don't have that confidence. And today's tips are also going to help you with this one. So welcome all my life viewers, Paula. Happy honeymoon, girl, <laughs> watching all your posts. Great to see you live. And drop me new in the comments if you bring you. Also, let me know, comment, what or who do you want to attract? What or who do you want to attract? That's what I want to know from you guys. And today we're gonna, I'm gonna share with you three tips to become more attractive. And by attractive, I don't mean nothing physical. I mean that energy, that charisma for others, okay? It has nothing to do with your age, with your education, with who you are, where you live, or how much money do you make, how successful you are. It has nothing to do with it. When you watch influencers or leaders that you are attracted to, what are you really attracted to? Why do you watch them? Why do you come back and want to know more from them? When I watch someone, it's because they are helping me. They make me do more. They, they motivate me to take more action and I actually learn something from them. So it's about the content, high quality content that is changing something in me, that is serving me. And that about it's, that's what it's all about. It's about high quality content and how you can help others. It's a game of serving. Okay, it's about how you can help others more, more than anyone else. And it's not about competing, but really who can give more. And the three things that will make you more attractive go along with that. So first thing is you need to forget about what you want or what you need, because it's not about you, it's about them. People are not attracted to needy people or, or to people that are desperate. So you need to stop wanting and stop expecting something from others and really start giving, start really serving with no expectations. Hey, Joni. So that's number one. Number two, is focus on your strengths. And I really mean that. Like, if you don't know what you're good at, try as many things as possible. I love saying that be brain, brave enough to be so, uh, be bad at something new. Be brave enough to be, be, to be bad at something new, right? So really focus on trying as many things as possible Learn about yourself, what you're good at, what you love to do, and do more of that. And honestly, I am not some talented, special pe person that is super good at something. It's about doing something and learning it so you're becoming good. Being on video, I was so terrified. But because I have hundreds of videos behind me already, lots of hundreds, <laughs> then... I really got used to it and it I don't fear it anymore. Like my strength is about is really I'll do whatever it takes. I'll do it anyway. If I fear it, if I'm bad, if I don't feel like it, I do it anyway. And I'm even when I'm you know, I can hold myself accountable with this. Like even when I don't want to do something, I I can immediately talk myself out of that. And, and honestly, the best thing that helped me with this was five second rule from Mel Robbins, because I know 
that the reason why I feel that, that's exactly the reason why I should go and do it. And I do it. I can make myself do it. So that's what I'm good at. That's my strength. So you have to know yourself what you're good at and use it. Use it to your advantage. And third thing is you need to demonstrate to people that you work with or to your audience that you are actually willing to walk away from any opportunity where you feel uncomfortable, not not uncomfortable, but unvalued or unappreciated. When people don't appreciate you or what you do for them, that's not your tribe. You will not work with those people. Those will not be your customers or that will not be your tribe. So be okay to walk away from these people. They are just not your cup of coffee. Okay, so be okay with walking away and let them know, let them know that you're fine because that's the confidence, confidence that people are actually attracted to, okay? Three things that will make you more attractive. And I have a few updates for you guys because I have been on Facebook a little bit quiet as I was preparing some new things for summer season and the rest of this year. So I did little redesign to my visuals. You can actually see one on my on my screen right now. So from now on, on my fan page and most social media, uh, not only Facebook, but all social media, I did little rebranding as far as visuals. I'm, I'm staying with my colors, but I'm just putting it more into one specific layout that will be more recognizable as who I am. Uh, so with that, I started also like two campaigns at the same time. One is no talent needed. I'm actually going to be using hashtags for that. So no talent needed. I believe this is business and this industry, you don't need any special talents. You just need the decision and determination and consistency and patience to learn it and actually do it. Everything, when we start, we're usually bad at everything. Like we have to learn from scratch, from zero. We have no email list. We have never done video. We have never written any perfect copy. So no talent needed. That's not what you need. And the second one is one day left. One day left, um, that will be second hashtag for those campaigns uh, regarding really the attitude that you need, like really start now, do it today. There's no tomorrow, do it today and do it like there's only one day left. It has to be done now. Like stop waiting, no procrastination. So these two campaigns will be or already are launched. And I want you to ask if you like more business tips, trainings, um, really what I can help you with on business level that's all going to be happening on my fan page. After the video, I will actually put all the links below in the comments to what I will mention. So you have uh, the links and you don't have to search for that. So my fan page will be all business tips, trainings, news, whatever will be helping you to grow your business. That will be there. So make sure you follow the page and turn on the notification. And on my uh, on my personal one, on this page that I'm broadcasting from right now, I will be more on that relationship building level. So I want to really separate that and because we don't want to be sold to, right? We don't want really, we are here to connect and I'm usually using the personal profile to build the relationships anyway. So I want a specific place to help you with the business really concretely. So that will be on my fan page. Second thing, you've probably noticed I've launched, not launched, but relaunched my YouTube channel, posting Monday, Wednesday, Friday consistently now. So new videos. And since I'll be uploading this video definitely to YouTube, if you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe. Okay. And there's a little bell button next to the subscribe button. So make sure you hit that one because you turn on notifications to see when new video is uploaded or when I go live on YouTube. Okay. 
Another thing, during the summer, I don't have the launch day yet, but during summer, I will be launching a new podcast. That podcast will be specific just for, I don't want to just say too much, just preferring the content and strategy at this point. The strategy will be online business oriented and for network marketers specifically, but it will be outside of what I do on other social media. So third thing is podcast or fourth thing already. And um, like a center of it all will be my group, Grow With Lenka, where like everything that is happening, so I don't just cross promote too much, then this will be a place where you don't want to miss anything that is happening around me either on on other social media or let's say the podcast, like different stuff that I share on different platforms, that group will be center of that also. I'll definitely put a link to that one as well. So you know, you don't, if you don't want to miss, then that will be a place that you want to uh, follow. And John, feel free to share also your value if, if you have something that you want to share with the audience in the group, feel free to share your value as well. So that's all. That was three tips um, that help you attract. Definitely leave me in the comments who or what you want to attract and the links to all of that. Hold on, sorry. The links to all of what I've mentioned to all the updates, I will put them below the video. So um, whatever you want to follow from now on, uh, you will have a link for that one. So great to have you guys all. And if you drop replay in the comments, as I've mentioned in the beginning, I'm actually pronouncing some. No, I'm going to make you watch the replay. I have something for replay viewers. And if you want to know what I have, you have to watch the replay. <laughs> so great to have you guys. And I'll see you soon next time. Bye.